Hello everyone, welcome back to our channel, Hi Sagittarius Fire Sign. Today I am going to do a complete love reading and this is general may or may not resonate to everyone. So take what resonates and leave the rest. If you like my content, please do like the video guys, then it will reach more people. And thank you so much for supporting me. So let's see your messages. Sagittarius Fire Sign, Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus. First we will see what is happening in your love life. If you resonate with that, do watch it, otherwise don't force to fit in. So let's see what is happening in your love life. Sagittarius, fire sign, sun, moon, rising, and Venus. And this is a collective reading, guys. Overall energy of your relationship. Wow, Ace of Cups. Want to clarify? Some of you are dealing with Libra or Sagittarius under the deck judgment. Okay. Right now, you both are in separation. Because a lot of controlling issues are there in this relationship, especially recent past, there was a passion uh, and you both want this relationship, but a lot of controlling issues were there. Then, a lot of waiting game, balance is missing. Uh, so, Seven of Pentacles, it's all about waiting game. And temperance taking the control of your life into your hands. It leads to separation because uh, nobody is taking proper action here. A lot of ego clashes, controlling issues. That's why you both are separated right now. Uh, three of Swords with Queen of Swords. You both are taking your power back. Uh, nobody is taking the proper action and judgment definitely decision making passion is there still and thinking about new beginning ace of cups here ace of cups represents uh self-love you both are focusing on yourself because right now you both are in separation yes you both missing each other because three of swords but you both are not showing this energy you both are showing queen of swords energy i am okay with this separation but you are not uh, you both are Definitely missing each other and thinking about new beginnings also. But uh, you both are not ready to say the truth here. And here yeah, judgment for some it is mutual also. Controlling issues, resistance, dominance. So let's see your post and current feelings towards you and your feelings towards them Sagittarius. Your person current feelings towards you. Eight of Pentacles under the deck. Ace of Wands with the strength. Now they want new beginnings here. Now they really want to invest on this connection. Uh, they know this connection has potential because the strength card is here. Uh, some of you are dealing with Leo. Is your person still thinking about you? They're still thinking about new beginnings here because Ace of Wands is here. And Eight of Pentacles, yes, they want to work on this relationship. Because they are very, very attracted to you. Some of you are dealing with the Gemini 8 sign. So let's see your feelings towards them. Two of Wands, you are overthinking about the situation, Sagittarius. Wow. You know this is your person because two of cups with knight of cups. But for some you have options. Someone brand new is also coming in your life. Sagittarius. You have options. That's why you are thinking about your options. 
and things are turning into your favor some of you are dealing with leo but you have very strong emotions towards this person you still love this person two of cups and your person was the reason for the separation here but you still love this person but someone brand new is also coming towards you sagittarius so keep your options open so let's see your person next action towards you will you take any action or not three of wands two of swords see your person is at some crossroads and I want to clarify seven of wands. Magician. Okay. They will fight for this connection. Yes. They will fight for this connection. They don't want to give up on you, Sagittarius. Maybe they are doing manifesting techniques to manifest you back into their life. They are still intentionally, they are at some crossroads. Intentionally, they are not making some decision regarding this relationship. But they don't want to lose you. That's why they are doing manifesting techniques to manifest you back. And some of you, maybe you will receive some communication or text from your person. And because without you, they are going through a tougher moment. Uh, it is not easy for them to deal with. With this separation cycle and page of cups definitely communication ecology so they want to work on this relationship three of pentacles it's all about partnership so will you take any action towards your person let's see they will fight for this connection sagittarius the sun under the deck no you are thinking about this person a lot and lot of inner conflict is within there is lot of inner conflict is going within you you are thinking about your options uh, sagittarius you are very happy now you are very grounded uh, yes if this person want you back they need to offer stability commitment so let's see what is the outcome of this relationship and where this relationship is headed up. High priestess, trust your intuition and follow your intuition. It will lead to your right path. Wow. There is a lot of passion and attraction between both of you. Mutual passion. Uh, definitely communication. You will receive text from your person and apology or communication. And you're both wishing for this connection. Uh, definitely both will communicate very soon. Soon. And you both will talk about stability or reconciliation here. Uh, and some secrets involved here for some. Maybe you both need to express your feelings with each other. That is the message here. Some of you are dealing with Gemini or some of you are dealing with Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, lot of fire energies here. So definitely both wishing for this connection, lot of passion is there and you both will communicate soon. So let's see what is the advice for Sagittarius regarding this relationship. Wow, Ace of Pentacles. Sagittarius, uh, definitely new beginnings. But for that you need to let go of something. You need to leave something behind for this new beginnings. Maybe uh, overthinking or uh, anger issues. Could be anything. So let's see rom romantic love messages. Past life relationship, you have known each other before. True love, this is the romance of your lifetime. Stay optimistic about your love life. Positive thinking and faith will bring you romance. So definitely this is true love and you both have past life connection with each other and stay optimistic about your love life. So think positively and faith will 
bring your romance so this is the reading for you guys hope it resonates to you please do share like and subscribe my channel and click the bell icon then you will get all my video notifications thank you so much for watching and supporting me please do like the video guys thank you